Okay, we are starting with the 20s. Starting with the 20s. It's such a fun age group to, to dress. It's young, fresh, you can experiment with color and fabrics. Mm -hmm. You know, really, in your 20s, you're starting to develop a sense of style. So yes. it's, a, it's a good time to play around. And you can show a little skin. Yeah, because everything, hopefully, is it's in all its tucked and place. tight in its place. So <laughs> the first thing we're going to start with is this great bubble dress. I love the colors in it. It's got that 60s retro vibe going on, sort of poochie that I love. Okay, let's talk about the 30s. This seems to be the perfect age. Well, you can still take some risks and have some fun, but you don't want to go too far. What I love about this one is it's a short sleeve. The designer's played with sleeve length. This is a nice sort of distressed wrinkled look because who has time for ironing in their 30s? I mean, who can bother? So what are we looking for in the 40s? Well, in your 40s, you usually have a little bit more money to invest in some nice pieces, but you still want those pieces to be versatile. So that's what I've brought today. The first piece is this gorgeous Tory Burch tunic that I just love the embroidery. Um, so it really pops. And it's easy to take it for an afternoon look by pairing it with some Bermuda shorts, some wedges, you know, perfect for an afternoon out. Now the 50s are a great age. They are. And in your 50s you want to choose classic pieces that you feel confident in and that's what we have here today. First piece is a classic white button down shirt. In fact, I don't care what age you are, yeah. every woman should have one of these in her closet. We've got our MTV stylist, Jen Michael, here. She's going to give us some quick and easy ways to make your look go from afternoon to after hours. Right, Jen? Absolutely. And you know what? There's no better time than now to do it. There are so many fun, great, stylish pieces that are out that can easily transition from the beach to your evening activities without making you feel like a total beach bum. All right, let's go find some people on the beach and transform them. What did you come in in? I saw you had um, some black shorts. Booty shorts. OK, <laughs> the booty shorts. <laughs> well, not that there's anything wrong with the booty shorts, but maybe you're going to be heading out later. We might want to dress it up a little bit. So I thought this little cutesy girly frilly skirt might look really cute because it'll pick up on the green. These are cute little leather sandals that are really simple and easy, but they have the gold trim on them, which will make them look a little more dressed. So go ahead and give those a shot. One of the easiest tricks you can do, um, since you won't need your sunglasses as soon as the sun goes down, use them as a headband. So go out, have a great time. You look adorable. Good luck. <laughs> Thank you. Bye. Bye. I love these ripped up, torn up jeans. Easy thing, throw a pair of funky heels in your bag. Okay. That'll dress up your outfit a little. It's actually a really adorable little piece because you can either wear it as a skirt, but I think what we could do for you is throw it on as a tube top. So what I have for you here is a pair of uh, khaki colored cargos that I'm just gonna have you throw on over your suits. And the look is wrinkled already, so that's gonna help you out. Light colors don't show wrinkles as easily. It's collared, short sleeve, lightweight. It's gonna make you look a lot more pulled together. We're going to hook you up with some serious pros, starting with our very own super stylist from MTVU, Jen Michael. Hey ladies, how's it going? Good. Good. My name is Jen and I understand you girls think that your good friend Emily here could use a little help in the fashion department this spring break. Is that true? Yeah. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, Emily, our first stop of the day is American Eagle Outfitters. They have every spring break essential that we could possibly need, so I think we're going to have some good luck here. Are you ready to go? I'm ready. All right, dive in. I like this. What if we did it in a brighter shade? They have a whole rack over here. Okay. I like the flowers. This is cute stuff. How about this? Little dresses. That's scaring you? It's kind of scaring me a little bit. I think we're going to try it. CBS 2 News this morning. Well, it's interesting, the sort of uh, general rule of thumb this fall for handbags is that there are no rules. Pretty much anything goes. What are the things I think
think that's interesting that we're seeing in handbags this fall are the pops of bright colors. And usually we don't see that in fall. We more see that in spring and summer. But we found that handbags have really taken their cues off what was happening on the designer runways. It used to be that whites were only for summer or winter whites. Now we're seeing it all year round. If you're not afraid of color and prints, there's so many fun options out there right now and really at every price point. These, both of these bags here are from a phase. They retail at $32. So not going to break the bank, but you're going to look like you're in the know, you're on top of fashion. I kind of feel like now bags are the new shoes. It used to be that a woman uh, would open up her closet and you'd see 100 pairs of shoes and we thought nothing of it, but she might only have a few handbags. Now it's that woman should have 20 handbags. This is WBAL TV 11 News Sunday morning. This weekend I was doing a little spring shopping at mm -hmm. Tyson's Corner Center, and I found that, you know, there really is something to fit every budget. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if you want to go designer all the way, I'm going to show you some looks that you definitely should have this spring. Or, you know, if you're like me and your budget isn't always as designer friendly mm -hmm. as you'd right. like it to be, I'm going to show you how to get some of those looks for a little less money. Okay. She is dressed head to toe in Nordstrom, mm -hmm. and she's more of a designer look. Her dress is by D&G and looks great, and we've paired it with some gold Mew Mew heels, mm -hmm. which the metallics are another big mm -hmm. trend we're seeing. But it is important to remember, if you're going to do metallics, save it just for your shoes or your handbag. Otherwise, you can get little space agey <laughs> Judy Jets in. You don't, don't want to go that far. Because okay. it is important to remember that, you know, when you're shopping at a, you know, department store mm -hmm. like Nordstrom, mm -hmm. that you should take a look around because a lot of the designers are offering, you know, some other options okay. at more affordable prices. So it's she has cute. a very, yeah, very similar look. And mm -hmm. again, a white eyelet dress. Hers is Michael by Michael Kors, mm -hmm. and it's only $159. Mm -hmm. Another one of our big trends this spring is the trench coat. It's a classic. It really never goes out of style, mm -hmm. but we're really seeing a ton of them right now. This one is by Burberry, and okay. it's a classic coat. It's been, you know, in fashion 20 years ago. It'll be in fashion 20 years from now. My favorite mm -hmm. trend this spring is the shorts. You can wear it with flats, mm -hmm. wear it with heels. Just make sure you wear them. Something I like to do is mix up a sort of menswear inspired fabric with a nice delicate little feminine top. Mm -hmm. Do it with a crop jacket. We got her look at Bloomingdale's. Mm -hmm. Her shirts are around $165. Okay. Uh, totaling her look is around $900. But I'm going to bring out Joelle here. Where are you going? Here. $900. <laughs> okay. But Joelle here, you'll love this. <laughs> Very similar look. Her shirts, shorts are $20 mm -hmm. from Forever 21. Uh, the shirt I love, we got it at Martin and Osa, mm -hmm. a white linen mm -hmm. shirt, very in the spring, crop jacket, the wedge heels. Her total, $185 for the entire look. That's pretty so good. So the best thing you can do this season is really mix and match it up. This is Today in New York. Perhaps this trend is influenced by today's young and stylish sports stars like Dwayne Wade, Tony Parker, and Rafael Nadal. But the Queen Center Mall's Jen Michael says you don't need to be paid like a pro player to get in this game. You can spend anywhere, you know, from 68 to $78 here at a money exchange. You can go to Foot Locker. You can go to Gap. I mean, there's so many stores that are now offering sort of, you know, body wear, comfort wear, fitness wear. You can find it anywhere. And then just pair it up again with your blazer and, and shirt.